Lipton. I'm the vice chair of the Toronto Island Community Association. And this isn't so much a question to the panelists, but a challenge to the media that's here. Why now? Why is this the mayor's plan come forward at this time? And who's behind it? You might start looking at the fundraiser for the mayor's uh, pay off the, uh, the debt. And you might follow that road all the way down to the Hearn power plant. And you might come up with some, some reasons why and who. Okay, I'm, I'm basically nobody. I'm not a problem I have with the waterfront in Toronto. I hear it's a great plan. Why is it not being implemented? Okay, and the people in my neighborhood, I ask people what's in this waterfront plan, we don't know what's in it. I mean, for better or for worse, the Ford plan, you can say there's a Ferris wheel and there's a this and a that. We don't know anything about the waterfront plan. The reason I'm here is because the, the Ford plan seems so half-baked and awful to me <laughs> that I resolved that I should come in and uh, find out what the waterfront plan is about. So, to me, uh, a job needs to be done around, you know, publicity for the waterfront plan, if it's so great. Yeah. Yeah.